alongside a man who's level on 11 points with him, Ty Wolfenden. Niels Christian Everson needs a couple of points at least here. Win preferably is off gate three. And Matty Zagar is the rider off the outside gate, followed by the semi finals and the final. And the uh, good thing about Grand Prix Speedway, we're always guaranteed a last heat decider. We'll have the same <laughs> tonight. Yeah, so far we have, yes. Absolutely. <laughs> heat 17. Here we go. Lindback and Wuffenden level on 11 points apiece. Off the inside two gates, who's going to get there? Lindback's made a beauty. There's no room for Wuffenden to cut back. So Wuffenden's gone to the back of the race. Would you believe that? It's coming through as Zagar into second spot. Wuffenden now battling away. The lead is with Lindback. Zagar now trying the outside run. Here comes Zagar. Wuffenden is third. Niels Christian Everson at the back. And Wuffenden now trying to really turn the bike hard to get the better of Zagar up the inside. He had to turn the bike hard now. Other one, he would have ridden into the side of Zagar. Limbach is inspired again. Zagar's coming on strong here in third place. Wuffenden running wide. Zagar even wider. Down the back straight, neck and neck. Zagar and Wuffenden. Zagar, I think he's got the better of him. Yes, he has. Going to be really tough. Wuffenden again lifting. Zagar now to the inside. Nothing to choose between those two. Brilliant speedway here. Lindback's got the race in the can. No problem at all. But who's going to finish second? Uh, Wuffenden clamps the line. But listen to the crowd here at Melilla. What a... Inside here in red, Michael Jepsen Jensen, gate two in blue, has been in the thick of the action tonight. Matty Zegar goes off gate three in white, and Bartosz Marslik, the local boy, well, you have to fancy his side. What we're going to get from him this time, didn't score in his previous race. Marslik on the outside, the favourite. Yes, and that's a good start from Kasper's out. What a start indeed. Now up the inside, the man in blue, Michael Jepsen Jensen, and now coming through Zegar in white. What a ride uh, from Matty Zegar in the white helmet colour. Smarslik's not done yet either. The battle is on going into lap two. Zegar the leader. Jepsen Jensen in blue is in second spot. Smarslik third. And KK Christoph Kasperzak trailing at the back. Yeah, brilliant stuff from Zegar. Took the opportunity with both hands out of that first corner. Needed to. He's not having a great night. Smarslik didn't make a good start at all from gate four. Really did struggle. He's had to work hard to get into third. Jepsen Jensen, well, He's going to have to ride like his life depends on it because Smarslik is going to hunt him down right to the checker flag. Into the last lap. Zegar's cleared off. Looking very strong here. Turning things around. Jepsen Jensen really having to dig deep now. Yes, he is indeed with Smarslik trying absolutely everything here in heat number 12. He needs to up his game, otherwise he's going to be overhauled by Lindgren and Wuffenden. And Dudek's out of gate two here. Yes, Malinsky off the inside, Dudek off two. Matty Zegar, what a ride he had last time out. Gate three, outside yellow. The brave war horse Piotr Pavlitsky picked himself up, dusted himself down. Now Dudek with a super ride from the start at the beginning of heat number 15. Now they're punching up down the back straight. Pavlitsky tries the inside run, but Dudek is there. Super stuff from Patrick Dudek to Zegar. block the challenge and coming around the outside. Sorry. Matty Zegar. Zegar's got lots of speed. Zegar's up the inside. Zegar takes Dudek wide oh, on. Pavlitsky's gone, gone down. down. Brilliant ride from Zegar with the red light. The red lights are going to have to come, come on. on. Yes. Yeah. Dudek, Zegar, Pavlitsky, your lineup. What was it like as a young British lad coming over to Poland and riding for a Polish league club? Because you were fairly young, Kel. Tatum's autobiography. Right, P number 15. It's a good start from Patrick Dudek. Now, can Zegar get the outside run around the outside? Here he comes! Up the inside as well in yellow is Piotr Pavlitsky. And Patrick Dudek has been beaten up there in heat number 15. The lead with Zegar. Dudek's coming through to second with Piotr Pavlitsky, but hats off to Matty Zegar. He is riding world-class speedway here. Fabulous ride from Zegar. All credit to him to be able to reproduce the sort of form he showed in the initial staging. He's fast, really fast, looking for back-to-back -back wins. Real battle for second place between Pavlitsky and Dudek. Dudek responding, getting the better of Pavlitsky, who's now just a little detached in third place. But this race has been dominated by Zegar. Zegar looking like he's going to go on to second and consecutive race wins for him. And he's going to move to within five points of a top eight place in the World Championship, which is the all-important spot, eighth place for next year. Two riders on a warning here. Piotr Pavlitsky off one and Matt Sajanowski off two.
Jacket number three is Matty Zegar, the Slovenian. And off the outside is Max Frick in the yellow helmet who uh, made on that they can start exploring the outside right line. Here we go, heat number eight it is. Can Janowski get there? Oh, and now Piotr Pavlitsky on the inside holds the run. What can Janowski do? Here he comes, a bit of magic from Matsy Janowski. And he needs it as well, doesn't he? Uh, the man at the back in yellow is Max Frick, who's very much on the pace. Oh, take off! On the outside. Now, oh. Zegar into second, Pavlitsky third, and Max Frick has packed up at the back. It's not his night. No, it's not indeed, but Zegar, that was a very clever move from him to get up the inside of Pavlitsky. Terrific ride from the Slovenian. Not his own. In the first corner, I, know I was saying that the outside line isn't working. It worked for him, a treat. He got the better of the opposition, and he charged the front. Keep your eyes on Zegar. Zegar is working hard in second place. Just over a lap to go, can the Slovenian get the better of Janowski in front? Yeah, he really is, is having a real go here. Looks quicker than Janowski, but just locked up there. Now he's uh, trying the outside run, but Janowski, I think, has probably just about done enough for the victory here. Matt Janowski to the line. Freddie Lindgren goes off gate number two in blue. Yeah. Uh, Kai Huckenbeck, the wild card off three, and Peter Killerman, always good to watch for whatever reason. He's off the outside in yellow. Yeah, it can be a little unpredictable. So far, it's written really nicely as well. Good tussle here. Yeah, but here we go with heat number 10. It's a good start from Zegar off the inside gate. Charging hard now as Freddy Lingren tries the inside run. But uh, it is uh, Matty Zegar who has held the line nicely. Third place is Killerman. And Lingren went square there and almost got into trouble, but got the uh, bike back under control. Zegar with a convincing lead now. Freddy Lingren is second. Third place is Peter Killerman. And the wild card Kai Huckenbeck is trailing at the back. Zegar fast out in front. You just sensed that the bike was fast all night, but he hadn't got away from the tapes. He's used Utilize the inside gate. He is really roaring away out in front. Freddie Lingren is no slouch and he's left him. And Lingren really is nowhere to be seen in second place. Zagar at his very best here. Gotta say, a bit of a battle out the back. But this race is all about the Slovenian. Peter Kilderman's in third place hanging on, but Zagar is really looking very accomplished here. Very significant this because Holder, Pavlitsky, Limbeck and Zagar all on 61 points behind the top eight but that by the way so a big race for him yeah. Zegar off two Limbach off three and what about that only one point for Bartosz Smarslik tonight oh, he's off the outside a nightmare evening for Smarslik who's so much better than that and just since this year he's just been trying a little bit coming up then here green lights on and away from the start who's going to get there first Vasilik off the inside run Lenbach tries the inside oh. here comes Zegar down the back straight they're all punching up superbly here but the man in the red helmet colour Martin Vasilik looking good from Matty Zegar Smarslik has come up the oh. inside it's a third spot right now they're riding fast and furious now on this track and it's a good ride here from Vasilik in red yeah great stuff once again looking like he could go back to back race wins here for Vasilik didn't start the night very uh, strongly, but he's certainly coming on strong when it really matters. He's utilised the inside gate and he's riding well, really well. Zegar in second place is now coming under a little bit of pressure from Smarslik, who really has found points very difficult to come by indeed. Into the last lap, Martin Vasilik, this is a credit to him, he's riding really well. Vasilik on to nine points, Zegar will move on tonight as well and Matt Zianowski, world title contender, his night is over with this result, it's a win for... He's got a better opportunity. Holder, Zegar, Dudek is your lineup for the second semi-final here. You need to get Calvin a cup of tea, please. Right, second semi-final. Here we go, second time of asking. Take tries, and it's a good start from Chris Holder once again, and Zegar has taken Dudek wide, and a lot of ground for Dudek to make up here, but Holder has the lead. Now Lindgren, which way will he go? He's got into the... the I said Lindgren, it's uh, of course, it is Matty Zegar, Lindgren's yeah. in the pits. So uh, here we see it, with Holder in the lead, it is uh, Matty Zegar in second spot, just holding Dudek at bay now. Yeah, Zegar's quick and looking very threatening in second place. Dudek! Oh, oh my goodness, I thought he was going to run in the back of Zegar there, he's got it wrong. Zegar so far in second place, he's searching for a way through. Dudek has now regained himself, but it's looking unlikely he'll make the final. Zegar very quick in second place. Zegar looks a lot quicker than Holder, doesn't he? He is. He's uh, having to get off the gas. He's trying the inside oh, run. And now he's past him, and now Holder's going to come back up the inside, is he? Hasn't got the speed. But this is a good result in the title race for Jason Doyle, who'll be watching, because his main title contender, his rival, is not... Speedway Grand Prix 
It's Matty Zegar off the inside in red with a lot of speed under him tonight, that's for sure. Uh, gate number two in blue is Martin Vasilik, uh, who has needed a big performance tonight. Now, Jason Doyle, nine points ahead in the World Championship race. He will lead the series going to Stockholm in a fortnight, but by how many? Who uh, rides for Swindon Robbins in the British League. He is the man in the white helmet. Here we go, the grand final here in Zetero. Good start from Matty Zegar off the inside gate. Now charging up the inside, Jason Doyle. Here he comes. Doyle in white, but Zegar holds the line. The man in the red helmet colour. Vasilik is around the outside in blue as well. Great stuff here. They're all folks step going into lap two. Paul oh. with the man at the back, but the lead here is with Zegar. And Vasilik has come around the outside, and Doyle is third. Brilliant stuff. Zegar away from the inside gate. That is proving to be terrific from him. Vasilik working really hard. Doyle just not able to get amongst it in that first turn. Vasilik now just nearly running in the back of Zegar. Zegar was so impressive in the semi-final when he passed Holder. He's out in front. He's looking like a winner this evening. Really good out in front. And less than an hour to go for him. We're going to have yet another different Grand Prix winner on the podium tonight here in 2017. It's marvellous. Matty Zegar in the red helmet colour takes the chequered flag. Second place, Martin Vasilik. Third, Jason Doyle, who has a 10-point lead in the world title race, going into round 10 in Stockholm in a fortnight. But what about that from the super Slovenian, Matty Zegar? Fabulous ride there from Zegar. The semi-final was out of the top draw, and he produces a superb final. Away from the inside, there's delight in the camp there. Celebration time for Zegar. He's had a tough season at times, but recently has found form. Brilliant ride from him. Doyle won't be too disappointed. He's on the rostrum and a good lead in the championship for him to take to Stockholm. But for Zegar, a terrific ride from him. Doyle, you know. Oh, yeah. Because he's 10 clear now in the world title race. Yep. And um, that is huge for Jason Doyle. He will go away from here a really happy man, Kel. Absolutely, because, you know, he's more than doubled his score. He's trebled his score, in truth. He's